Alright guys, hello, hello, welcome to Hardy on a Budget. Okay, I went ahead and got this, these envelopes, so I figured I'll go ahead and swap them on here. Um, because I love watching stuff like this. Now, this is really horrible, so I'm just going to go ahead and take all these out these are ridiculous okay I got these ones because I don't have the zipper and I'm hoping it'll allow it to close since it doesn't have the zipper, but we'll find out. So test your strength. And that's by Kimberly Budgets. This one is Angel Numbers. This is also by Kimberly Budgets. Farm Yard Frenzy. My Kimberly Budgets. <clears throat> Let me just stick a couple in here. Okay, now that I got quite a bit of them in there. Alright, so Farmyard Frenzy, I'm going to go ahead and probably just stick a lot of hers together. So this is Money Manifestation. This is probably going to have to go into my game thing. So then we have her tarot total up, which is going to be another one like that. Um, Advent 2024 is probably just going to go on my savings challenges. Okay, sorry, I had to turn the baby's toy down. So, this scratch off is by Cindy Cat Budgets. Is that all? I don't think that's all I have of Kimberly's. So, let me put this one up front. Because I want to keep all her stuff together. Alright, these ones are by. Oh my goodness, I forgot who these ones are by, and I didn't write them on the back. Um, I don't remember, but all of these are linked, every bit of them are linked down below, every single one of them. Okay, so, the Save 2024 one did come with its own envelope, so I am going to keep that, but I'm going to shove it in the back. Um, and there was a couple of them that came with their own <clears throat> so those ones I will be putting in the back. Okay, this one is by Spooky Budgets. It's um, I'm assuming it's Roll the Dice, that's how I've been playing it, but it's like a little zombie girl. I don't like zombies, y'all. <laughs> I love fantasy and stuff like that, but I hate horror. I cannot stand horror. 
Okay, so this one's another one that came with their own stuff. And look, y'all, they put so much work into this that I am definitely not changing them out. So this one is the B one, and this one is by Reynolds Budget, I believe, but I will have it not I will have it down below. Then we have the 10K challenge. I know I have too many challenges going on, but it's okay. Oh, this is my savings one. Duh. Okay, so we will stick this in there. We will just put spare money in here. <clears throat> okay, this one doesn't um, have the zipper on here, so we're going to go ahead and just pop this bad boy back in here. That one's by Spooky Budgets. This one, I actually don't remember who it's by, but I think the name is on here. Um, Sam's Crafts and Customs was a mystery challenge. I think I won it, or it came with an order that I had placed back when I first, very first started. This one's the 52-week budget, and this is by The Average Budget. Again, this was one that, from when I very first started budgeting, this one is by Cindy Cat Budgets. This is her um, cute 30 week challenge. <clears throat> I have another one by her, so we're going to keep it together. Um, these are the Hello Kitty savings one. I know that one says something, but I've repurposed that envelope. It's not going to hurt anything. This one <coughs> is a spinner challenge, and it is also by her. I don't want that one up front, so... Ooh, the only thing I didn't think about is the money falling out of these ones. It's the only thing I didn't think about. So we're going to put this spinner pet challenge back here, and then we're going to also put her stuff back here just because I want to keep those together. All right, so these ones I don't have a dashboard for, so I'm going to keep back here as well. Um, these are the cards. I need to make her a dashboard. And while we're back here, this one, um, I think it was Reynolds Budgets, so I'm definitely going to do that. Deck of Cards is, why is that in here? I thought that was a, that's a, mm, did I put that in here because it was not like a game? I thought it was more, okay. <clears throat> so, Deck of Cards, and then, okay. So, we're going to do her game one. So, this one is also by Kimberly Budgets. All her stuff is so stinking cute. Super, super stinking cute. And then we have her whack-a-mole. Look how cute that is. Y'all, I ordered so much from her. It, it's not even funny. But her stuff is so, so cute. All right. So this one is the Silly Goose Challenge, also by Kimberly. And then my last one is Llama Loot, also by her. Okay. So clearly... Do I have enough room to make it snap now? Oh my god, I don't. What if I take this one out? I will if I have if I take that one out. Okay. <clears throat> so we're gonna take her scratch offs out. And I'm gonna leave one that I've already scratched off in there. So that I know which why. I have random money. <clears throat> okay. 
pot cacao is, so, is one of my favorites, so we're going to stick that in there. So, do I have any more blank ones? I don't. I mean, I was able to condense quite a bit. But I need three more. So, this one is by Bees Budgets. This one is also by Bees Budgets, so we're going to keep those two together. And then this one is by Golden Girls Budget. I have a lot of challenges, but that's it. Okay, I'm definitely one of those personalities. Alright, moment of truth. Oh my goodness, so it actually is able to finally... Oh my god, I got those damn pieces everywhere. Okay, so we got this one done. Let's go ahead and work on our other one. Our other one is able to close, but it's still really thick. But a lot of those are games, and they come with their dashboards, and they come with their... Things, so I don't know exactly how much we will be able to get in. These little buggers are everywhere. Alright, so let's see what we can do on here. <clears throat> okay, that one's created. We can't do that one. We can't do that one. We can do this one. And this one is the um, Savings Land by, I don't remember. This one is one of the ones that I got when I was very first started budgeting. Alright, so. <clears throat> this is going to pop everywhere. Alright, so there's that one. I can do Roll the Pigs. Tetris has its own, so we're going to leave that one alone. Yossi has its own. Uno. Clue. Duck, duck, goose. Oh, that one's tight, tight. I'm going to slide this back right here because Kimberly Budget's stuff is coming up next and I want to keep all her stuff together. Because I know I'm going to be back on her site when she has new stuff, like I already know. Alright, so Duck Duck Goose. This one, oh, that's a dashboard so I can go ahead and swap that out. <clears throat> This one is one of hers, not another card game.
open the bottle. Duff Bucks. Look at her stuff. Her stuff is so good. Like, y'all, when I say I bought a lot, I bought a lot. Alright, I'm already starting to get a little snug, but it shouldn't be more snug than the zipper, so I don't have one in there at all for that one. <coughs> Bingo is one that we're going to keep in here. So, hook a duck is Kimberly's. Bingo is design. Scrabble is design. Solo. Um, we are going to go ahead and keep those in there because they were already in there. I know they're repurposed, but we're going to go ahead and keep that. So, then there is our game one. We have so many games. All right, guys. That is it. So if you have trouble like me buying a whole bunch of stuff, instead of doing the zipper ones, go to the envelope style ones. Um, they are definitely, they're going to be the same in like the body, but they don't have the zipper. So it doesn't, you can definitely close your stuff a lot better. All right, guys, if you made it to the very end of this video, let me know what kind of envelopes you prefer. And they don't even have to have this be this PVC one style. It can be like the laminate ones, anything. And then leave me a um, game controller emoji. Bye, guys.